How to factory reset a Wii U unit, even when it's locked because you forgot or don't know the parental PIN code or Nintendo Network ID account password. This can be helpful when you purchase a system from someone and it's locked. I made this video because I purchased two systems from a local store for cheap, but they were each locked in different ways. Other YouTube videos were okay, but didn't have all the information. After digging around on the internet for a couple of hours, I found the fix on a message board. I thought it'd be helpful to put out this good to know information in a video. Here's the short answer. I learned that you can fix all of the problems by calling the Nintendo support phone number and having a support person walk you through the steps. This is the number from the site that I called and was good as of January, 2022. If you're willing to wait on hold, they do a great job. And I must say the representative that helped me was amazing. Best support call ever, no joke. But you can do some of the fixes without calling the Nintendo support line. Here's the long answer. First, you need to know the difference between a local account and a Nintendo Network ID connected account. Any accounts that have the orange box with a white N are locked to a Nintendo ID. All other accounts are local accounts. To do a factory reset on your own, you must have access to a local user account so that you can access the main Wii, Wii U menu. If all accounts are locked to Nintendo IDs and you don't have the password to one of the accounts, you will need to call Nintendo support because they will need to detach one or more accounts from the Nintendo network ID before you can move forward. Support will ask you for the serial number off the bottom of the console. So you want to write it down and also have the system turned on and ready to go. If you have access to the default account, you can also access the serial number and the software version by clicking on the system settings, then console information, and then click support information, then system environment. The serial number is number three. They will also ask for your name, phone number, email, etc. Okay, here are the fixes that you can do on your own. One, a factory reset with access to the local account and no parental lock. Two, a factory reset with access to a local account and with a parental lock on. There is one where you'll need Nintendo support to help, and that is a factory reset without access to a local account because all the users are connected to Nintendo network IDs. So how to factory reset the Wii U when you have access to the local account and no parental lock. To do this, access the main menu under the local account and go to the system settings. Then go to the last option to the right and click on delete all content and settings. You'll be asked to read the information on your TV screen, click next, and then click delete everything. And you should be all set. Now, if that doesn't work, how to factory reset the Wii U with access to a local user account and with the parental lock on. If at any point you're asked for the parental pin number and you don't know it, using the local account, select the system settings icon and then access the date and time settings. Write down the date. You'll need this information later. Then go back and select the parental controls icon on the main menu. You will see the screen telling you, you must know the pin number to continue. Don't hit the next button. Instead, tap the I forgot button at the top of the screen and then click the I forgot again at the top of the next screen. You'll be given an um, inquiring number. Write down this number and then pull up your web browser. Go to the following M key generator website and select the device type Wii U in the top box. In the next box, put the date you verified on the system. And this may not be today's date. Don't put anything in the third box. And in the last box, put the inquiring number you wrote down and click go. A master key will be shown at the top of the page. Write down this number and return to the parental controls page. Click next and enter the master key here. This will unlock the parental control settings. You will need to then click on delete all settings in the top right corner and then click delete. This will remove all parental controls so that you can go back to the system settings and complete the factory reset 
by selecting Delete All Content and Settings. As of January 2022, it was still up and running, this website. For if some reason this site has been taken down, you can call Nintendo Support and they'll help you do this. Now this third scenario of how to factory reset the Wii U without access to a local user account. This third scenario was the one that I wasted so much time looking for. If you don't have access to a local account because all user accounts are locked to Nintendo network IDs and you don't have the password, then you'll need to call Nintendo support and they'll need to help you detach one or more accounts from their Nintendo network IDs before you can factory reset the system. They'll walk you through the steps, but as stated in the earlier part of the video, support will ask you for the serial number off the bottom of the console. So you'll want to write it down and also have the system turned on and ready to go. They will also ask for your name, phone number, email, etc. This is an important point. Even though you only need one account unlocked so that it changes to a local account to do the factory reset, if there are any accounts locked to a Nintendo ID on the system for users under the age of 13, these accounts will also need to be unlocked before the system will let you do a factory reset. You will know this is the case because the system will tell you and support will help you unlock and delete any such accounts so that you can perform the factory reset. Here are the steps that they'll walk you through to unlink the accounts from the Nintendo ID. First, you'll be asked the username for the account you want to unlock, and then you will click on the user account and be prompted for the password. You will then click on the I forgot button at the top right hand corner of the screen. Uh, you'll get this message. At this point, you will use the secret Nintendo button sequence to get a code needed by support. They'll have you press and hold the Y button and then the plus button and the minus button all at the same time in that order. A code will pop up on the screen and after you tell them the code number three, they'll have you hit the back button and then they'll give you a 16 digit number that you will enter on the screen and click OK. Returning to the main screen, you should find that the, this account has been changed to a local account so you can go in and do the factory reset as shown earlier in the video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and give a thumbs up. This is what promotes our content and keeps us growing. Hey, I'm Joe, and this is good to know.